Remember the movie that put Nicolas Cage on the map, Valley Girl? Well, it has been turned into a musical. It's available tomorrow in select drive-ins and on demand, but only I went behind the scenes. They got the, beat, they got the, beat. the clothing has been incredible. The clothing is so on point. Oversized bows, keyboard ties, like way too much neon. Yep, the 80s style is in full swing in Valley Girl, and it should be, considering it's a remake of the classic 80s movie. What a hunk. Oh, yeah. Check out those tags. It's big boots to fill. <laughs> yeah, I'm a big fan of Nicolas Cage. Only E.T. was on set for the climactic prom scene. Josh Whitehouse takes over Nick's role, and Jessica Roth is your new Valley Girl. You may know her from Happy Death Day or as the friend in green dress in La La Land. Alicia Silverstone plays the all grown up Valley Girl. Leonardo DiCaprio's girlfriend, Camila Marone, plays her daughter. You were singing and dancing on a fountain. That's how I remember it. Okay, so there was no fountain dancing in the original, but the remake is staying close to its roots. Where are we gonna go? I don't care. Where would you wanna go? Anywhere. Members of the OG cast told the newbies stories from the original set. The other cast members kind of talked about all of the torrid fairs that happened on set. There was a lot of making out in trailers. And it looks like history repeated itself because Logan Paul and Chloe Bennett met on this set and dated for a few months after our very flirty interview. It just won't ever work. Yeah, it just probably won't. You shouldn't date people you actually like. Yeah, right?